Yo, dude, we did our first tattoo. I mean, it's not all done, but. Do you think he regrets it? You regret it, my guy? I think I centered it, maybe. He's sitting in a weird position. I wish he was laying flat while I did this. Smack it? <laughs> What's up, everybody? We're doing some tattoo action today. I want to introduce a special guest. His name's Tar. That's Tar. And we're going to be tatting him the fuck up. He doesn't want any tattoos, but I don't give a fuck. I'm excited, though. I've never, I've never really done this. I've done a, um, a little bit of studying, a little bit of note taking, and a little bit of practicing with this tattoo machine on flat, on this stuff, which is like fake skin sheets. And I've had very little success feeling like it's um, an accurate uh, experience to tattoo a, like a body part. So I, I got one of these and I've heard that these are a lot better and they um, simulate the experience of tattooing much better. So, Tar, big fan. I O'Neal, Tar, you have big fan. Say hi to I O'Neal. Tar's kind of a sick bitch. But uh, he's about to be sicker. This is gonna be fun though, I'm excited. So we have another camera set up. Hopefully, uh, looks okay. His name is Tar because that's rat spelled backwards. How long ago did he start tattooing? Uh, so I bought a tattoo gun. I spent a few hours watching YouTube videos, took some notes, and here I am. That's how, that's how much experience I have. So can I be hired? I will say, I uh, in, in the uh, little bit of research that I've done uh, to try to figure out how to tattoo, um, obviously Crocodile Jackson, my good pal and tattoo artist, um, he helped me and he gave me a lot of advice and help. So shouts out obviously to Croc, but um, the YouTube channel that I was primarily watching was a guy named Ben Fisher. If you're interested, I would look him up on YouTube. He uh, has a lot of videos that are really helpful and thorough about everything under the sun when it comes to tattooing. Um, and so I have a little bit of like just an ounce of knowledge that I got from his videos. Ben Fisher. Um, so just wanted to shout that out because it was really helpful. Mainly I was learning about the needles. Um, Cause I was curious as to like what makes, like what what's all that, right? Like what are these numbers, right? C12007RLT, that was like gibberish to me. But I learned that they all stand for something. Um, so the first two numbers, 12, that is the diameter of the needle. The second, 07, that's the needle count. So that's how many needles are in this needle. Um, RL means round liner. So there's sometimes like RS, which is like round shader, or F, which is like flat. And then T is the taper of the needle. So that's what that means. So I learned how to read the tattoo. Uh, needle code. Why a rat as opposed to another shape? It's a, it's a, like the company that sells this, it's like, it's their big joke, right? It's their big joke. It's the joke is, do none of your friends want you to tattoo you? Well, let this guy be your guinea pig. So they literally made it a guinea pig. So I got tattoo gun, got the needles. I think we just get started. We gotta figure out what we're gonna do though. So, move the ink over here. So, for your reference, we're using a 12 millimeter. Uh, well, number 12 actually, which is 0 0.35, 0 0.35 millimeter. So 12, uh, number 12, 0.35 millimeter needle. Seven total needles on this bad boy. And it's a round liner the regular taper. 
Are you freehanding? <laughs> uh, this is a rubber guinea pig, so yeah, I'm fucking freehanding. I also have this little pen right here, like this guy. So I could, like, you know, draw something and then go over it and use this as like a stencil. I think that's in. Beautiful. All right, where should we start on his butt? Or, or on his head? I want to write Rat Boy as the first tattoo. Butt tat? All right, we'll start on the butt. We'll just, we're gonna have Rat Boy. Maybe I do do a little stencil. Let's, let's do that. All right, that's our stencil. You know what, so I got this soap, something green soap, I forget the name of it. Super green or some some sort of green. It's what tattoo artists use. And I got it for, because I have like a whole kit, you know, as if I'm gonna tattoo a real person. And the smell of it made me want to go get a tattoo so bad, dude. Oh my God. Just instantly brought me back into the tattoo shop. So we got our little, can't see it from there, but. Meh. Focus. Uh, yeah. A little meter here. You can't see it's kind of off camera, but ASMR. It's actually a really quiet gun. Meter? This is a weird shape, dude. I have to like put him on his side or something. We ready, chat? All right, let's go. So there's a couple things that I needed make sure I'm uh, I'm focusing on. One of them is the angle at which I'm going into the skin. You know, when you write on paper, this, and this is all straight from the Ben Fisher videos I watched, but when you write on paper, sometimes you write like at an angle because it's more comfortable. With tattooing, you have to be really kind of straight up 90 degrees, you know, so it goes in evenly. Anyway, here we go. Okay, so that seemed to not even like go in. And I wiped most of the stencil off. That's fine. All right, we're starting, we're starting light. We'll get, we'll go deeper, you know. Oh, there we go. That's a bit better. Shockingly quiet, I know, right? I'm gonna do another line. All right, so I don't think I can really wipe away the ink without wiping away the stencil. Something about this pen. Thought it was made for that. What's the meaning behind this tattoo? Um, it's a rat. I'm, I'm kind of just freehanding at this point. This is fine. What does the R look like again? Oh, a little small guy, okay. I think the coolest part about tattooing this little fake guy is trial by fire, just learning how deep you have to go by doing it. Like, how else would I be able to get that sensation? Like, get accustomed to it, you know? All right, that's our first letter. Oh boy, this is gonna be a doozy. What does the A look like? Okay. So this is a round liner, meaning this is like good for line work. I probably should have a round shader or at least a 
a higher needle count liner. I don't know, because this is like thick font, but whatever. I wonder how, how bad does this hurt? He won't tell, he, he's not telling me the pain level, so I don't know. <laughs> I don't know how, how, how I'm doing. Well, how many stars on Yelp are you gonna give me? You got a high pain tolerance? All right, I think I'm, I'm, I'm straying a little bit from the, uh, the uh, stencil, but we gotta thick, thicken up some of these lines. I think that's okay. I can't tell what that's looking like yet. 3.1415 stars. You're giving me pi stars? What is a T? A okay, T, this is gonna be tough. I'm like holding my breath. Is that what I'm supposed to do? Okay, T needs to be a little thicker. All right, I really should wipe this away to see how it's staying. Oh, okay. Oh, dude, it's it's staying. A little closer for you. So you can see because it's a it's a it's a liner. Like I need to really pack it in because it when you put when you like when you're doing it, the ink sits on top of the skin and it pools a little bit and it looks thicker than it is. So let's go over these lines a bit. I was talking to my mom today and she was like, I was like, I gotta work later. And she was like, what are you doing? I was like, I'm uh, gonna tattoo a rubber guinea pig on the internet. And that's my relationship with my mom. <laughs> All right. Okay. I went a little deep there, I think, but I'm not sure how that was. I can't tell like how this looks. I think it looks okay. All right, so there's a little space on the A. Let's fill that in. That's probably one of the things I don't understand most about good tattoo artists, like how they how they know what they're doing looks is gonna look like while they're doing it, like how they disregard the ink on top of the skin. Just use an orange? I don't want to waste fruit like that, dude. Because I'm not going to eat it after I tattoo it. That's pretty disgusting. Imagine getting Rat Boy tattooed and it's taking this long. All right, that's fine. <laughs> well, don't tattoo the inside of the orange then. Well, I wasn't gonna tattoo the actual inside of it, but if you tattoo <laughs> the outside of a fruit, I feel like it's not smart to eat it. Hey, 
Hey, a friend got ketchup in their eyes and said it burns. Guess that's Heinz sight for you. Jesus Christ, that was. All right, we're moving on to boy. What does the B look like? All right. Oh boy. I kind of took liberties with the B there. It's not supposed to go down like that. Kind of a racer. I guess it looks okay. Has, have I taken a bite out of the guinea pig yet? What the fuck, chat? Do a little heart in the middle. Ooh, that's a good idea. We gotta, let's do O and I, and then we'll thicken up the letters. O, all right, so we gotta draw a circle here. Uh, I think that's good. All right. I'm doing this? Rat bow. Okay, now I. I is pretty easy. off the letters. Yeah, I could be doing this much more efficiently with a better needle for this type of uh, tattoo, but whatever. It looks, <laughs> rat looks bad. Boy looks okay, I think. Let's try to fix, okay. I think we need to thicken up the T a little bit and the R actually. Okay, the R looks a little bit better now. We gotta thicken up the B. My guinea pigs are watching this with fear in their eyes. Yo, y'all want next? <laughs> People who are just getting here, what the fuck is happening? 
You're a natural. Oh, thank you, Dan. Thank you for, uh, for saying for saying that. I'm not, but I appreciate it. It's weird because I can feel it catching, which probably is really painful for tar, but fuck them. Okay, the eye needs work. The eye looks wrong. But we gotta fix the B. What's it called? It's called a tattoo machine. That's what it's called. Yo, dude, we did our first tattoo. I mean, it's not all done, but. You think he regrets it? You regret it, my guy? Wash this bad boy off for you. The green soap. Yeah, it's the good stuff. Okay. The eye is kind of busted, but I think I centered it, maybe. He's sitting in a weird position. I wish he was laying flat while I did this. Smack it. <laughs> Heart in the middle. Oh, I'm scared. That's a scary thing. <laughs> Nobody clipped that. Um, Part in the middle. We can, uh, nah, I don't want to, I don't want to push it. Let's be done with this one. And let's do, let's move on to something else. What about a piece of cheese? Ooh, a piece of cheese is a great idea. Let's look that up. Cheese sketch. Okay, this right here. All right. All right, rat boy, we need some cheese. What if we do cheese like behind his ear? Like right here. That could be kind of sick. That's a pig. Pierce his ass. I'm, dude, I don't have any piercing equipment. I'm just tattooing, alright? One thing at a time, dude. Alright, Tar, you ready for number two? Oh boy. It's gonna be uh this is going to be a tough one. Fuck. Okay. I kind of want to stencil this. Fuck. But this stencil pen doesn't. Oh, shit. This is called a surgical marker. Jesus. I don't know. Yikes. 
Yikes, dude. All right, let's do this shit. <sighs> I'm like holding my breath. Nervous chat. I'm gonna try to go over the whole thing before I wipe it off because I don't want the stencil to go away. We can wipe it now. Jesus, dude. Fucking crazy. Okay, so yeah. See how much was just sitting on top? It's much thinner now. Oh, you know what I should be doing? Some of this. I don't know why. Oh. It's too much. They use this, right? It's like, what is this stuff called? Stencil stuff. It's called stencil stuff. I don't know if that's gonna help or not. How hard do you push? So I don't know how to describe it. Like I'm definitely getting in there, um, but I'm trying not to go too deep. That's one of the things though, like I said, with a fake canvas is like, you'll never know what kind of pain you're causing. This is making me want to get an appointment so bad. Grecia, dude, same. I really should have more light. I really should have my, like my headlamp or something. That's what crack does. Like that shit was crazy hard to like remember where I am. Spank clip is on Twitter. What the fuck, dude? I didn't, it's Photoshop. I didn't really do that. Okay. Damn, dude. All right, we gotta finish the outline then we can get to the little shading lines. My friend Julian has cracked at tattooing pigs. <laughs> oh shit. Cracked at tattooing pigs. Is that on my uh, Twitter bio now? What's up, Cooley? Cooley here? All right. That's good.
This makes me want another tattoo. Dude, just imagine smelling the green soap. That That's what really makes me want a tattoo. All right, my lines are okay. Like I'm kind of, I'm kind of doubling back in like different directions. Oh, another thing you're supposed to do is stretch the skin out. So like if I was tattooing myself right here, I would want to go while I tattoo, right? That's what you're supposed to do. But because this fucker is rubber, there's no, you don't have to do that. I wonder if Tar woke up today and knew he was getting a cheese tattoo. I don't care. Is he squishy? You know what would be a wild sensation is tattooing yourself and like. Like, that's just a weird thought. Like, what if it hurts and you're like, yo, chill. And then you're like, oh, sorry. And you're like, it's my first time. And they're like, wait, it's your first time? And they're like, yeah. And you're like, I didn't know that. And you're like, well, you should have asked. And you're like, well, you're getting the tattoo for free. And you're like, wait, I already paid you. And you're like, yeah, well, it's too late. I'm not refunding you. Look at this. This is a nice little fucking mess here with this rag. All right, so I think the, the, dude, this is actually a cool tattoo. I kind of want a slice of cheese because I'm a rat. I already know the shading lines is they're going to be such a bitch. Okay, now, so it's a good thing we have a round liner because we're gonna need, holy shit, this is gonna be hard. I need like a magnifying glass for these lines. I'm from Wisconsin, I would 100% get a cheese tattoo. That's a cool idea, yeah. It feels illegal seeing Julian at this angle. What angle? What do you mean? What do you mean? Forgot about that cheese hole up top. There we go. All right. We need to fix that line. That guy needs some more juice. Let's do some of these uh, really fine line shading. This is gonna get bad. All right, let's try. Like how am I supposed to even track what I'm doing when it gets all blown out like that? Please put a single chip on him. 
one single chip, Papa. Please, Papa. I maybe didn't need to do the shading. Maybe that was a little extra, but it'll give it a little depth, I think. You can't even really see it, to be honest. It's too small of a tattoo to have these shading. All right. Why is it not fucking focusing? Hello? How are we looking? All right, so we got Rat Boy, and we got the cheese behind the ear. Dude, he's looking kind of sick. He's looking kind of sick right now. Teardrop? We could do a teardrop. Fuck it. Can you do, oh my God, the Twitch smiley emote per Tay's request? Fuck. That's a tough one. I could probably do it. Let me try. Let me do a teardrop first. Shut the hell up. I'm doing a teardrop. Do I fill it in or no? Maybe like a little bit so it looks like there's um... Like a reflection, you know? That looks better, I think. Maybe a little more up top. How's the pain level, my guy? I don't care. All right, got a teardrop. to an eye? I'm not doing an eye, dude. Tar killed someone? Is that what that means? All right, we're gonna... I should try a different needle. Let's see. I got a 12 diameter, 14 needle count, brown shader. This guy is a much thicker needle. Huh. Do the mom heart. We could do the mom heart. That's a classic one. Let's do, let's pop on a new needle. What is a round shader? So let's, I just kind of want to try. Oh, this is a big boy. Oh. Shit, there's so many needles. Can you see this? There's so many, I don't have a macro lens right now, but yeah, that's a big boy, damn. I'm kind of scared to use that one, not gonna lie. Let's put that one over there, maybe, maybe in a sec. Let's see what else we got. We got 12 diameter, 11. Okay, so this one might be better. It's 11 needles and it's a round liner. Let's try that. Okay. 
This is also scary, but could be fun. So. All right, I'm gonna draw the mom heart. Is that how I do it? I don't know. I think I fucked that up. Um, mods instead of mom? That's a funny idea. Woo, it's a big boy. Oh, hey, Julia. Woo. This is a big boy. I'm scared. But this is why we're here. We're practicing, you know? Do that again. This is going to be tough because I don't think I'm going to wipe away the stencil until I'm done with one full pass through. Oh, I fucked up, chat. I literally fucked up. Because uh, the banner is supposed to go in front. I can fix it. 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 I'm gonna fix it. I'm gonna fix it. I have no idea what this fucker is gonna look like when I wipe it away. It's gonna be so small. I'm gonna wipe right now. Let's see. Uh, not bad. Not bad. Not as bad as I thought it was gonna be. I'm still gonna fix it though. I'm still gonna fix it. So, check this shit out, dude. All right. Oh, I'm in the zone now, dude. Oh, this is bad. This is bad. Help. 
Oh yeah. I think I just gotta make the lines bigger for the banner and it'll look a little bit better. It just says mod, not mods. Pick your favorite mod, band. What we could do that might make this work better is color the heart black. So the letters and the banner sticks out. You know what I mean? Cause right now it looks like a stencil or like a fucked up thing. All right. Oh, should we put on the round shader? We should. I don't know if you're supposed to take needles off and put them back on. Probably not, but it's a fucking rubber guinea pig, so. All right, so. This is, uh, this is the shader right here, chat. comes off. All right, so I need to pack the color into there. Keep packing. Would you ever tattoo yourself? Yeah, probably. I would just want to get some experience. That's why I'm glad to be doing this, you know? I wonder if I need to be up in the, the number on the motor here oh oh damn now we're pumping this is at this is at eight i was at seven before 
I really wish I knew what that meant. Y'all hear that change? It sounds... Ooh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Make the heart bigger, it'll fix it. You know what? I think I want to keep cranking this number up because for shading, I want it to be really cranking. Oh yeah, look at that. This is hard to do in a small space right here. Whoo! It also is, I think, a bit of a handicap here to have to hold him at an angle that's like i wish i had this hand to just like wipe away while i go you know maybe i just turn him on his side i don't know but then you can't see that well let's try this just for a sec bear with me Oh, it's much easier to be able to do that while I go. It still looks like a cover up because of the line. It's fine though. I, I like, I drew it wrong on this stencil, so it's my own fault. All right, let's do a little more shading on the back banners. I'm having a blast, dude. This is fucking fun. This is fucking fun. Also gives me a whole new appreciation for tattoo artists. Uh, an appreciation of which I already had a lot of. Let's 
such talented people I know. All right, we're putting the, the liner back on. I don't know, I think I should just stop. All right, let's go back to this liner and let's do another design. Yeah, rat boy still. Ooh, let's drink some coffee. Forgot about this. Yeah, shouts out to the mods, dude. This one's for the mods. Stream logo? Mm -mm. Do awa awa eyebrows? Dude, it is so small. I guess we could, our, our eyebrows. That's kind of funny, actually. Um, we need the 12 needle round liner for that. Or wait, no, the seven needle. I think that's what this is right here. No, this is, hold on, let's see. Yeah, we just had it. All right, we'll do our, our eyebrows. That's a good idea. Let's go back to this font. I kind of want to, I think cranking it up helped pack the color, pack the ink in there. Did ass be looking like a tattoo artist with your fit? <laughs> All right, let's draw it with the stencil. Okay. We'll do, actually, I probably won't get too fancy with Talk about an awkward spot, my God. <laughs> Browa Browas, that's too much. Time out. All right, move your stupid ear back. Okay, so what I'll say is, when you crank up the speed of the motor, or the machine, it, the color just packs in much, much easier. So I think I was going on hard mode before, and this makes it a lot easier. All right, now we just gotta touch up the A and we're done.
Oh, meanwhile, I wiped off the other side with my stupid fingers while I did that side. I think I can still sort of see it though. Hella awkward position, my god. This guy's a champ, dude. He hasn't asked for a break once. Let's put a little of this uh, stencil stuff. There we go. Did that get in your eye? I don't care. Okay. All right, super awkward, but let's get back in and finish with the letters. I'm like trying to talk while I do this, but I feel like it's hard. I feel like it's messing me up. reason this side is hard. it's harder dude a rose Oh, that was bad. You guys like the sound of the needle buzz? Dude, this is, okay. It's relaxing, nice. All right, well. Awa. Awa. Awa, awa. Here, I'll show them up here. Damn, he looking mean, my dude. Give him a little green soap. All right, no activity for a week. Keep it clean, keep it moisturized. Chest piece. He doesn't really have a chest. There is room for like a big piece. There's room for like a... How hard was it to start learning? Um, you're watching it happen. So medium hard, I don't know. Like I, I'm comfortable drawing. Like I draw on my iPad and stuff. 
It's just, it's the application that's hard. It's understanding like how deep you have to go and like how to keep track of your lines while the, the ink starts to pool up. iPad has that streamline. Yeah, there's no streamline on tattooing. Skull tattoo for the back piece. Got to figure out what to do on his back. Mm-hmm. I think I like the 12 liner. That's what I'm using right now. 12 needles, 14, no, 14. Wait, no, hold on. This is the seven actually. Yeah, seven liner is my favorite, but that makes for like really thin tattoos. We can bump it up to do the, uh, there's the round shader and then there's the round liner. Yeah. Recreate one of your tattoos? No, I don't, I feel like that would, not turn out well. This has made me both nauseous and sleepy. Oh, I'm happy to help. Hmm. Could you like something, some sort of circular design? Give him a real ass. What the hell? Serendipity, it's a meme on TikTok. I'm gonna take the seven out, I'll put the 12 in so that we can do a little bit of a thicker design for the back, not as fine, fine line. Actually, we're working through some of this ink pretty good. Literally just a circle. Wow, that's exciting. All right, you want the Twitch smiley face? Holy shit, this one's gonna be tough, dude. I don't know why, but it's gonna be tough. It's like, it's such a specific shape. It's not a circle. Where could we? Let's do it right here. Shoulder? No, I'm not. I'll just keep it over to the side. Hmm. 
All right, we gotta go. All right. Oh no. We went a little crooked on that one there. Yeah, we're 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 a little off base here with these lines. This is difficult. Because with a design like this simple, I feel like any little mess up is very clear. Oh boy. Oh boy. Nothing like your tattoo artist saying, oh no. Yeah, that would be my problem if I ever tattooed. If I did something that wasn't perfect or, you know, I thought I messed up, I would just be like, oh no. Nice little heart attack for your client. His ears are not even at all. Fuck. Yeah, I don't know how artists talk to their client, dude. I'm holding my breath. Oh, man. little bit crooked. It's kind of cute though. Ah. 
I actually want to add these little things on the ends of his ears because I think they would help. I think I need to make his eyes a tad bigger. Let me, what do I want to draw? What do I want? We could do the, the, the rose with a lightning bolt. The thing about tattooing this guy is, is like, it's small, dude. It's like your tattoos are, I kind of want to do a big one because I feel like I would be able to, it would be a little bit more clean. I don't know. Monstera leaf. I, I kind of want to do this. I don't want to do a rose, but let's just pick one. Draw your crooked ass pin rack. Okay. This is actually kind of a helpful um, graphic right here. I'm gonna try to, oh, it's getting dark in here. Yeah, I need better light. This is not great light, but whatever. All right, I'll do it right here. Let's do All right, that's not too many lines. I think we can manage this. I think we can manage this. I don't have color ink, nah. I just got one color. I think we can do this, chat. We gotta, we gotta go for it. All right, we just, we just gotta try. There we go. We're going through the whole design in one go. I don't have the type of stencil that stays on.
All right, it's gonna be a lot less saturated when we wipe, but we'll have a, we'll have a start. Okay, that could be worse. It could be worse. Yeah, I like the seven needle. The seven needle round liner is my favorite so far. Are you going to tattoo yourself? Maybe. Maybe at some point. I don't know. If I get to a point where I feel like I'm not just complete trash at it, I might. Or if I get bored enough. shade yet I think in the future I might go like with an overhead cam because propping this thing up is exhausting a little bit Actually, going to improv a little bit in the center. Uh, Ichigo, Ichigo Taruto, thank you for the sub. Welcome, Moogles. Pamela Ashwood, thank you for the thirty-five months. Uh, C Seya, thank you for the resub. Oh, we need to go over that again. Tyler, welcome. Does that look like a rose? I don't fucking know, dude. Am I missing a line? Oh, I am. pedal well all right we're doing the little lightning bolt stem are tough.
boy. How's this gonna look? Looks a little bit busted. I'm going to shade the bottom of these lower petals. So we can see that there's like a little bit of distance there. That looks a little bit better, I think. Dude, I don't know what I'm doing. Chat, thank you for being kind. I appreciate it. I'm really just here for fun, though. It didn't turn out completely awful. It could do with some shading, like, inside the petals. Oh, man. Um, or even maybe inside the lightning bolts. I don't know. You never see me on stream with these glasses. These are like my daytime glasses. And you'll notice that they just fucking slide down my face now because they're all stretched out, busted. The struggle of someone who puts their glasses on too rough and accidentally sleeps in them sometimes and stretches them out. Thanks for reminding me to push up my glasses. Got it. Me, I'm that person. All right, let's give him a little, let's take a new piece of, give him a little, little wash. I just, honestly, I just wanted to smell this stuff. Oh, it smells like tattoo shops, yes. Use hot glue where the arm meets the body. It will help them. It will help tighten them against your head. Use hot glue where the arm meets the body. I have literally no idea what that means. Oh, my glasses. What the fuck? I was like, what are you even saying? Oh, <laughs> oh, so like hot glue these, this little corner right here so that they're a little bit stiffer. I don't know. I actually just ordered another pair because <laughs> this is like my only current pair. And if these go down, I'm kind of fucked aside from my like PC glasses, but I don't like to wear those outside because I don't want to break them because they're, they're gaming and screens. Um, yeah, Jenna, Jenna Dragon, thank you. I might actually, you know, when things open up and whatever, I might take these to 
an optometrist or lens crafters or whatever, have them refitted. One, one coat black on the rat's nails. Hmm. He doesn't really have nails. He just kind of has like little nubs. World's best boss mug. Dude, the, the, I've been doing this for two hours. The fact that artists do this for like long, like long days. I don't know how, man, that shit is tough. They really out here. I'm excited to see how these heal. Pierce his ears? Dude, I don't want to pierce anything. Spank it again. No, I didn't do it the first time. He's actually kind of looking sick. My dude is looking kind of sick with these tattoos. Let's give him another little, little green soap bath. Yeah, nothing quite gets me in the tattoo mood like smelling this green soap. My goodness. There's a nice spot like right on the top of his head for something. Huh. What could we do there? Cowboy hat. Oh, I like that. This is a very, very symmetrical tattoo here. And any sort of fuck up will be very visible. Yay. Okay. It's fine though. We're here to learn. I think that's the beginning. Like that. And then up. Then we gotta go straight across. So I think the only issue with this is it doesn't go up enough on the sides. There we go. Can't unsee it looks like a frog. All right, well, he's getting two tattoos then. It actually kind of looks sick unfinished like that. You're scary good at this. I would definitely let you tattoo me at a party. <laughs> um, I appreciate the compliment though. It kind of looks almost like it's supposed to look like that. 
Like one of those like uh, very like sketchy thin line tattoos. I don't know. At a party. <laughs> All right, we gotta finish it though. Can't have an accidental, an accidental win. It's gotta look like we want it to. So this is a new hobby. Well, got a tattoo machine and I'm stuck at home. So yeah, if you will, it is a new hobby. All right, let's give him a little bit of the stencil stuff. I think that actually helps with. I don't fucking know what I'm doing. <clears throat> Julian drinking tequila and giving himself a tattoo. Why can I see that? Because I'll probably do it at some point. That's probably why you can see that. Hmm. I really wish I knew how to shade. I guess we should just practice. I guess we could, could just practice doing some shading right now. Let's do, um, okay, let me go over this hat line one more time. Where's the pedal? Where's my pedal. All right, let's get the round shader. That's this bad boy right here. Yep, pop on the old shader. And we'll do some shading. So I'm gonna try to shade underneath on the sides of the hat. We gotta learn how to shade somehow, right?
Okay, that's that's a bit intense. I didn't actually want it to be that dark, but it's good to know that we can pack that color. Shade the uh, the little uh, leather band or whatever. You know what I'm starting to notice is like if I focus on where I can like look at the needle, right? And if I look directly at the needle and not all the ink that's coming out of it, I can kind of have a better idea of where I'm going which is cool. Sorry, this is a bad angle. You have to kind of really focus though because it gets so crowded when the ink starts to fly out. You have to really find that needle. Let's clean them up. Clean up tar. like a frog. <laughs> While well, we did our first like shaded tattoo. Kind of cool. Looks like a cow. Sort of. like a hat yeah oh that's a lot so weirdly i think like the stencil stuff doesn't like do the same thing on this fake canvas as it would on a real person but dude I, okay as far as like how it feels to tattoo this thing it's so much better than doing those little those little skin sheets. Like these guys. This is how I first tried and I was so discouraged because I couldn't figure out the depth of like how the needle was supposed to go in and it wasn't like applying well. And this feels like there's actually a chance at me learning how to go the right depth and keep the right consistency with the speed and everything. This is fun. I'm fun, dude. Learning by doing. Dude, that's how I learn things. My dude, Tar is getting his work in today. Well, we got to leave some room on him for the next time we, the next time he books a session, right? How many did he get? He got the Awa Awa, the heart. 
So one, two, three, four, the cowboy, five, Smosh, six, Smiley, seven, Lightning, eight, Rat Boy, nine, Mods, ten, Cheese. You got ten tattoos. He's racking up the bill, dude. Add it to his tab. Jeez. That'll be a million dollars. Man's had a sesh tonight. Ten in one sitting. Yeah, dude. Banged it out. He's looking kind of sick. I definitely wouldn't fuck with him if I saw him on the street. All right. So. GG's on the tattooing. That was a lot of fun. Tar had a, a nice first session with us. Got all inked up. Uh, and I genuinely enjoyed, enjoyed learning uh, how to do this trial by fire. I kind of feel like that's my favorite way to do stuff is to just do it. And that's how I learned. And uh, thank you for joining me in doing that.